University of California Berkeley engineers have created a lightweight and durable robot that achieves exquisite control and agility by modulating the electrostatic forces between its feet and surfaces. With the help of these foot pads, the robot can navigate a Lego maze in seconds. Many insects and spiders get their uncanny ability to scurry up walls and walk upside down on ceilings with the help of specialized uh, sticky foot pads that allow them to adhere to surfaces in places where no human would dare to go. Engineers at the University of California Berkeley have used the principle behind these some of these foot pads called uh, electrostatic adhesion to create an insect scale robot that can swerve and pivot with the agility of a cheetah giving it the ability to traverse complex terrain and quickly avoid unexpected obstacles. The robot is constructed from a thin layered material that bends and contracts when an electric voltage is applied. In a 2019 paper, the research team demonstrated that this simple design can be used to create a cockroach-sized robot that can scurry across a flat surface at a rate of 20 body lengths per second or about 1.5 miles per hour, nearly the speed of living cockroaches themselves and the fastest relative speed of any insect-sized robot. In a new study, the research team added two electrostatic foot pads to the robot. Applying a voltage to either of the foot pads increases the electrostatic force between the foot pad and a surface, making that foot pad stick more firmly to the surface and forcing the rest of the robot to rotate around the foot. The two foot pads give operators full control over the trajectory of the robot and allow the robot to make turns with a centripetal acceleration that exceeds that of most insects. To demonstrate the robot's agility, the research team filmed the robot navigating Lego mazes while carrying a small gas sensor and swearing to avoid falling debris. Because of its simple design, the robot can also survive being stepped on by a 120-pound human. Small, robust robots like this could be ideal for conducting search and rescue operations or investigating other hazardous situations such as scooping out potential gas leaks. While the team demonstrated most of the robot's uh, skills while it was tethered or powered and controlled through a small electrical wire, they also created an untethered version that can operate on battery power for up to 19 minutes and 31 meters while carrying a gas sensor.